best thing I ever did was decide to come out and be trans at the age of 48. The producer and lead subject of a six-part documentary is hosting a discussion panel on gender and identity as a part of the series' final episode in Penticton on Wednesday night. We all have challenges in life, and so I really wanted to get to show people what it is to be like struggling through um, family issues and when people don't transition with you. Trans Man is a six-part docu-series uh, that covers Kyler's experience transitioning from female to male. Uh, Kyler's transition happened later in life and allowed him a chance to really consider the impact of becoming his full self and uh, it was a brave decision. Audiences will see the challenges Salmark faces since having transitioned roughly five years ago. My angle is still about the self-love because until I really loved myself I could not step through that. That was the last piece and I talked about that all my life but I also was planning out my death because I couldn't stand what I was doing or being. And I feel really bad for saying that because I was born a beautiful being. And I love women, I'm just not one. The hope is that the docu-series will provide conversation points for families, friends, and individuals who are learning more about identity. Every person who is brave enough to step forward and tell their truth has something to offer to somebody else who is questioning who they are. And so our hope is that the series is inspiring, that it is joyful, that it is heartwarming, and that it also highlights some of the journey that is still lies ahead. There's still a lot of work to do, and there's still a lot of pain and healing, and uh, we need to talk about it. The Tempest Theatre discussion panel begins Wednesday night at 7 p.m., with Choose Your Price tickets available online. The full documentary series will be available on Telesoptic TV in September. For Castanet News in Penticton, I'm Casey Richardson.